Hello and welcome to this month's Heatline video blog. This month, we're going to discuss the use of our Retroline mini product in a water softener backwash drain line. For those of you that are familiar with water softeners, you'll know that at least once a week, they need to run a regen or a backwash cycle. In rural areas, customers that have water softeners are commonly on what's known as a septic system, as opposed to a city sewer or city water supply feed. The downside to a septic system is you do not want to backwash your water softener regen cycle into your septic system. So what those customers need to do is supply a drainage line from the water softener that leads outdoors to a dry well or a French drain. In cold environments and extreme cold environments like in Canada or the northern US, there is a real danger of those drain lines freezing. Now, the further issue with those drain lines is that they're very commonly small diameter, as small as half an inch. So it's very difficult, if not impossible, to go inside. That's where the Retroline Mini comes into play. The Retroline Mini is an advanced, self-regulating, in-pipe heating cable system designed to go inside small diameter, problematic drains, pipes, tubes, anything where you have the potential for the water to freeze. And the added benefit of the Retroline Mini is that being self-regulating means it can be inside a dry pipe, which is at certain times full of liquid and other times completely dry. You never have to worry about over or under heating. So next time you need to install a water softener backwash drain line from your water softener system to a French drain or a dry well, remember the Retroline Mini can be the product of choice to prevent that pipe from freezing. We hope you found this video blog helpful. We'll continue to release a new video blog monthly. So make sure to stay up to date by signing up for our email newsletter, subscribing to our YouTube channel, following us on Facebook or our other social media pages. Thank you for watching.